Most statistics show that free trade in the United States has done nothing but harm over the past two decades. In spite of this, our leaders continue to endorse these PACs that only benefit their lobbyists and multinational corporations. But we already have plenty of evidence to show that entering into more of these dangerous agreements will only quicken our economic demise. The disastrous North American Free Trade Agreement has been destroying American jobs for nearly 18 years. As predicted by Ross Perot, we have witnessed a giant sucking sound as manufacturing has been moved south of the border to Mexico where workers are paid as little as $3 per hour. With no tariffs or restrictions to protect us, American companies simply cannot compete with these wages. Prior to the signing of NAFTA, the United States held a trade surplus with Mexico, but by 2007, that surplus had become a $91 billion deficit. The combined deficit with Canada and Mexico had risen to $190 billion, an increase of 691%. How can the American economy succeed at this rate? The U.S. Department of Labor has shown that more than 3 million manufacturing jobs have been lost and 300,000 family farms have been put out of business since the implementation of NAFTA. Overall, net farm income is down 13% since 1993. The harsh reality is that NAFTA has never benefited the American worker. It instead encourages our jobs to leave the country in pursuit of lower wage rates, non-existent environmental standards, and free trade without restrictions. We need to amend or eliminate NAFTA immediately in order to correct these serious issues. Unfortunately, there are additional free trade agreements currently being championed by our leaders that are potentially even more damaging than NAFTA. Tune in for the second half of our seminar to find out more about these other dangerous treaties and what you can do to stop them.